While it's great to ask questions in the comments and that's definitely going to help someone else who is looking for the exact same thing, a great way to help your community interact and help each other is Discord. Creating a link to invite people to your Discord server is not hard at all. You basically click on the Discord server dropdown, then click on invite people and then you get this link. But this link is only going to be valid for 7 days but you can edit it further and then you can modify the expiry to be never. And that's how you generate a permanent link to invite people to your Discord. Now this link should be pretty stable but there are plenty of horror stories on the internet of this link not working after a while. So if you truly want a stable link, what you can do is that you can create a redirect to this link from your domain. Boolean Art is using the Next.js app router. So within source app Discord, we create a file called route.ts which will essentially be an API. And within this, we bring in next response from next server. And then I don't like links flying around all over my code base. So I have a nice module called links that contains the discord link that we just generated. Now whenever someone tries to get boolean art slash discord, we will return a next response of a redirect to links.discord. Now if you look at the documentation for next response.redirect, it's essentially supposed to be the same as the web version as pointed out using the MDN link. And if you visit this documentation page, you can see that the redirect method takes a secondary argument called status and if omitted, it should default to the status of 302 found. And you can see that that is indeed the case with the web API response.redirect, the status is 302. Now let's compare this to next response.redirect, which we have now deployed to boolean art slash discord. I've paused the frame over here and here's something that might surprise you. We actually get the status 307. As an aside, this is still a successful redirect to the discord invite link that we created. Now the question that you should have is which one is better? The web standardized 302 or the next response version of 307? In terms of HTTP redirect status codes, there are actually three popular options. The first one is 301 which means moved permanently. Essentially, if you return the status, the browser might catch the response and will not attempt to hit your URL again because it knows that it was moved permanently and it doesn't need to ask you again. The other popular option is 302 found which doesn't actually specify if the move is permanent or not. And this ambiguity is exactly one of the reasons why we have the new HTTP status code of 307 which explicitly specifies that this is a temporary redirect. And so we have our answer that the next response version of a 307 temporary redirect is actually the better option.